This particular spark trap is one of our 12 inch varieties. This one, the customer chose the option to go with a flanged end that allows you to bolt it into your duct. We also have it available in a raw end so it can slide inside your ductwork or the outside of your ductwork. And it's also available on a quick connect for uh, to be able to clamp together with other ductwork. These come starting at six inch and they can get very large. So depending on the ductwork style that you have, it's possible you might need some hangers to support the weight uh, depending on the size of the, of the spark trap that you go with. We have a sticker that shows you which direction your airflow should go through. That way whoever's installing it into your duct uh, should not have make a mistake on which way it, it flows. Basically what you're looking at here is the side where the air is exiting the spark trap. You can see down at the bottom where the air comes in, the propellers, they actually cause the air to come in and shoot off the outside of the, of the spark arrestor, which knocks the heat signature off the outside of a spark, extinguishes it, so that it can then come up through here, has another layer of defense right here to stop any potential larger objects that may have been thrown in by an employee or whatever into your airstream. And then it just continues on out on its way to your dust collector. So the, the clean out door comes standard on all spark arresters. So in order to remove your clean out door, be able to sweep it out or, or clean it out with a broom, brush, you just loosen these knobs. They will allow you to dislodge the clean out door. Then take this off, vacuum it out, scoop it out however you however you see fit. Every every uh, spark arrestor comes with that with that available option. Please share this video and follow us on our social sites.